Hey, what is up guys? I'm here from AndroidRoots.com and should be showing you how to get free Wi-Fi tethering slash hotspot on your T-Mobile Galaxy S4 SGH M919. And this method is a very simple app. You just get from the Play Store and um, you'll be done. Um, but I only tried on my T-Mobile Galaxy S4. It could work on AT&T, Sprint, and Verizon. I haven't tested it. So as of this video, and as, as far as I know, I'm only going to say it works for T-Mobile, but it could work for other carriers. Um, you can try it. Nothing bad's going to happen. It's worth a try, but uh, for this video, just be aware only T-Mobile has been tested and confirmed working if you want to, you know, know for sure if it's working. Um, so there's only two requirements to actually get this whole thing working out is one, make sure your uh, data, your carrier has a data plan, so your contract has a data plan. And by that is make sure your 4G turns on, uh, surf the internet, and then you should be able to surf it on your uh, Galaxy S4. And second is that you're rooted. So um, you have to have super user uh, on here, and you should install the via Moto Shopper or um, Clock or Mod Recovery. Um, so make sure you're rooted and you have a data plan on your contract. Um, if you want to know how to root your Samsung Galaxy S4, uh, T-Mobile specifically, for this video, uh, click on the annotation right actually right over there, and I'll have a link down below, an article down below, for um, if you want to know how to root it. Only takes about five to ten minutes. Very easy to do, so not a big deal at all. Um, so once you have the, all that set up, go to the Play Store and go and search for Wi-Fi Tether for root users. I'll have a link about link down below for an article for this step-by-step -step guide video. If you know, if you want to uh, read it instead of watching this video, or you just want to link to this article or this app, I mean, um, it's much easier. So let's install it. It's a free app, so I'm just gonna open it up because I installed it. Tap a little option key right there. Go into settings change device profile, and scroll all the way down to Galaxy S4 right here. So make sure it's Samsung Galaxy S4. Do not enable Wi-Fi encryption. I ran into problems when I enabled that, so don't try it. You're going to run into problems. Um, maybe in a later update when he updates the app, it may fix, but as of this video, do not try it. It's not going to work. Um, you can change SSID. That's your network name. So for me, I did tethering Galaxy S4 for my example. Uh, tap OK. Go back and tap on the little Wi-Fi logo icon. And like I said earlier, you must be rooted. So just grant it. And now it's going to start it up. And while it is starting up, I'm going to go head on to my Galaxy S3 and then connect it and show you it's actually working. So I'm going to tap on Wi-Fi. And now um, let's uh, do a refresh. Oh, cancel it. So as you can see, it showed up right here. So it's tethering Galaxy S4. I'm going to tap on that. And it should connect automatically without a hitch because um, I don't have a password on there. Um, so it says connected now, and right here it popped up, it says something has been connected, so that was my Galaxy S3. And now you'll notice on download that number is going to go up once I do start surfing the web on my Galaxy S3. So I'm going to go to my browser and refresh Engadget.com, and you'll notice it's going to go up. So as you can see while it's refreshing, that went up by 30. And now let's say we go to, um, let's go to Lifehacker.com, I love that site, um, Lifehacker.com. It's a great site for learning DIY and all that. It's just nice life hacks. <laughs> so lifehacker.com. And look at that number. And while this loads up, and there you go. So that is how you get free Wi-Fi tethering. Super simple to do. Uh, you know, one simple app, and all you have to be rooted and have data. Um, but that is how you get free Wi-Fi tethering on your Samsung Galaxy S4 T-Mobile SGH M919. If you did enjoy this video, be sure to hit the like button and consider subscribing in the bottom left-hand corner as that does really help me out a lot and then shows me you support me. You want to see more of these great videos and I'll be posting more Android videos, not for just for Galaxy S3 and Galaxy S4, for Galaxy Nexus, um, Nexus 4 and just a lot of whole Android tips in general. So if you want to see more of these videos, um, not for necessarily Wi-Fi tethering, but you know, RAM reviews, app reviews, and you know, basically and or tips be sure to subscribe and uh, like this video if this did help you out and don't forget to follow me like me and add me on twitter facebook and google plus which is also an excellent way you can contact with me if you run into any problem using this guide um links down below for the written step-by-step -step guide rooting and uh, my social networks uh thanks for watching guys i'll catch you next time peace